there a way to make the gap between the multiple links bigger? I want to write more on the link and it looks messy. So ideally I want to make it fan out more. I tried to increase fan size, but that doesn't seem to do much. Hi, if I get your question correctly, what you want to do is you want to increase the space between the links. So this gap right here, correct? So if you want to do that, it's a simple one. You simply hold the shift key. So I'm, I'm going to click the shift key right now and hold down. And then I'm going to click on my label. So this link label here, I'm going to click on it and just simply drag it out. And that will do it. So you can hold the shift key and drag it out as far as you want. And that, I, again, I'm not sure whether that's what you're looking to do. What you're currently doing is adjusting the fan. Now, the fan is the distance between this point where these two lines meet and this node at the edge where it bends. That distance between here and there is the fan. So the larger the fan, so for instance, if I wanted to take these two and I wanted to increase that to make it look sharper rather than obtuse like the angle right now, I can simply right click, go to combined properties and then change the fan. If I change that to, I'll do something like 60, right? So you'll see a big difference. So if I change that to 60, it'll be pointier. You see how it's pointier now? So it's the distance between the point here and where it's perpendicular to the imaginary line that's across these two. So again, if you want to adjust that, you simply hold the shift key down and click and drag the label to the left or to the right, for instance. And you can adjust the spacing. That's how you would manually do it. Thanks for checking out this episode of the All About Analysis channel. If you enjoyed this video, smash that like, hit subscribe, and click that bell so you don't miss any of our new episodes. See you next time.